So I can see that the patient is sitting up and they're quite <coughs> breathless at the moment. So you can access the stethoscope if you hold out your palm. Yep. It should then give you an option to pick your stethoscope up. So if you pick that up, yep. and then if you take that towards the chest, um, you should be able to have a listen to your chest and listen for any sort of wheeziness there and let me know what you hear. Okay. Just like Steve's coming in to have a listen to. Stevens there, so awesome. Okay, to start off with, uh, I think I'm going to choose a non reboot. Okay, so. <laughs> we know that simulation plays an incredibly important role in the way that we train our doctors and nurses. And often that simulation is restricted. You need bricks and mortar buildings, you need access to very expensive equipment. And in mixed reality, what we're able to do is reproduce that simulation in a hyper-realistic way and bring that content through instructor-led tuition to the masses. They can access that content with nothing more than their mobile device, and they can do it from anywhere. over 90, so I don't think we have to give any acute um, fluids and not worry that she's hypertensive. Um, I'd like to do some bloods um, and an ABG.